Hi there and welcome to Andy Robinson RC. Cheers for joining us on the channel today and we have a new unboxing of the Tamiya 1998 Ford Escort Custom which you can see on the box there and it's a bit like a, a street version of the rally car. Uh, so yeah it's on the TT02 chassis. Now I know a lot of people aren't overly excited about the chassis that it's on uh, as it's been out for a long time now and it's one of Tamiya's um, more sort of budget four-wheel drive chassis but that's what they decided to do but I think enough people are interested in the actual body shell and the wheels and also it's got the new Tamiya electric speed controller which this is meant to be the first kit uh, that it, it comes with however I've seen uh, a couple of other people getting it uh, in like some of the fighter buggy RXs and things but generally this was meant to be the first kit that had it released in anyway we're gonna look at that in a little bit so let's unbox this for you and uh, let's see what you get all right there's Jim all right uh, you can sort of go there I'm sure you'll fall over in a minute all right let's take the lid off that and put that there Okay, so I'll pick this up and show you, hopefully without having really losing everything. So that's it there, in the box. Okay, uh, as I say, it's uh, just uh, lumped in a box, this one. Um, nothing like overly special like you get with the, say, the recent Tamiya Fighter Buggy RX Memorial Edition, or say the Vanquish or other things like that. Uh, this is a more, obviously it's a, a, a basic kit, uh, not a special release or anything. Um, anyway, let's go and have a look at what you get. Jim, you can go over there. Uh, right, uh, what should we start with? Well, that's the brand new electronic speed controller, which we'll talk about in a little bit. Because I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to open this and we'll have a better look at it. Uh, what I will do is, before I uh, brought this upstairs for unboxing in the studio, what I did do was put the wheels and tyres together, just because I think... It looks better to show you, um, and also what I'll do as well, I'll do a close-up on these uh, when I bring the camera over later. So, let me move that there a sec. So here you go, you've got the uh, classic white wa uh, wally, can't say that, rally wheels with the uh, Tammy tyres, which you get on a lot of their cars. Uh, but ace-looking rally wheels, and I think these also came on the... Um, uh, they did a Tamiya Escort rally on the TT01 chassis in its first incarnation without the, the support brace in the middle and the older style uh, steering uh, linkage. Um, I'm pretty much sure, though that was a rally style, a rally uh, livery, those are the wheels and tyres you got with it as well. So they brought them back, but I always like those wheels and they look superb. So we've got them. Okay, um... So I so said this body, um, although it appears like all new and fresh, especially in that white, um, you know, street looking um, version of the Escort, this body has been used before and it was on the Tamiya TL01. They did the Ford Escort Works rally car. Um, I think it was white and it had like uh, blue Ford logos from what I remember. Um, so they used that body on that, and then they also used it on the one I just mentioned, the, uh, the f one of the first iterations of the Tamiya TT01. Um, but they brought it back, so I think people are quite keen about this because you can now get the Tamiya Escort body again, which is always good. So, right, so we've got here, we've got some of the body parts. You've got the, the rear wing and the wing mirrors for that there. So that looks cool, I'm liking that. And then the big thing that everyone wants to see hey, is, let's just move that slightly out of the way. There you go, it's always hard to see these because they're blooming clear. This one isn't pre-painted like some of the other ones. Now, um, I'd forgotten that and I thought I was gonna show you a, a pre-painted body. Uh, but I'm not, so it is a bit more difficult on the camera to see, but there you go, 
That is the uh, 98 Tamiya Ford Escort custom body. Lovely body as usual by Tamiya, but also to help you, it does have pre-cut wheel arches, which I always think is a good move. Um, I'm always rubbish at doing the wheel arches uh, on these things. I usually get my better half to do that, and I've just dropped it. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I mean, it's a really nice body. Love this. Now, I remember these uh, being announced, and uh, at the time, it was like, oh, I'm going to have one of them, I think. But um, also, they released the Tamiya Mark II Escort Rally Car on the MFX01 chassis, and it was a, it was a sort of a, a choice between the two, and I went for the Mark II Rally, just because I prefer the older-looking uh, uh, Fords, personally. And um, uh, plus, I've never had an MFX01 chassis as well. And so that corner sort of won me over, really. Uh, this is a bit of a cheaper kit, though. But, um, yeah, so I went with that one. Or if that hadn't been released, I would have had these just simply for the uh, for the body. Uh, it's really cool. I like it. So that's the body shell that you get. We'll have another closer look at that as well when I bring the camera over. Now, what we will do next is we will have a look at this new Tamiya ESC. I've not seen one close up yet. I've only sort of seen it in pictures. So here we go. This is the manual for it, so I'm going to try and find the specs for you. Off it. Um, <laughs> it says we've got to find the English first. Excellent. <laughs> um, I found German and Japanese. It's in here somewhere. French. <laughs> ah, there we go. I've got it, finally. Sorry about that. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, so, uh, quick uh, specification. So this is, I wanted to do this as well, to read it so I, I get the name right, because I always get all the numbers and letters mixed up. So this is the new Tamiya TBLE uh, dash zero four S. Okay, so it's a censored uh, speed control if you're running a brushless. But again, it comes pre-factory uh, set up for a brush motor because you get the torque tune motor in the kit. Okay, now it is just slightly up the specs over the old TBLE O2. Okay, so here it is. This is what you. I mean, it does look pretty similar. But there it is there. I say we'll have a closer look at that later. But that is the new speed, speed controller. Now this is rate, rated at higher amps than the old one. The old one was 65. This is now uh, rated at 75 amps as well, which is good. Uh, weight is about 47 grams. Um, and let's have a look with the um, motor wise. I wanted to check this. If you use it, it says, well, it says here on the Tamiya um, instructions for it. Now, maybe it'll be slightly different, I don't know. But here, reading it, it says, uh, ESC is forward brake and reverse, uh, max continuous current 75 amps, input voltage 6.6 .6 to 7.2 volts, output forward uh, 100%, reverse 50%, dimensions uh, 41.5 by 33.4 by 18 millimetres, weight 47 grams, which I've just told you, compatible motors, now I'm reading, I'm going off what this says on the ESC instructions. And it says Tamiya brushless motors censored 15.5 turns or over, so higher. You can't go any lower than the 15.5 turns. And uh, and then let's have a look. Sport tune motors, uh, Tamiya brush motors, 25 turns and over. Um, so it's saying here that you can't use below a 25 turn. Um, brushed motor with this but I mean I'm looking at this I'll show you with the instructions in the thing on it says let me read it again compatible motors Tamiya brushless motors censored 15.5 turns or over so and then comma sport tune motors uh, Tamiya brush motors 25 turns and over yeah receiver output voltage and then it's 6 volts slash 1.5 amps I think that's what it says yeah Okay, so 
there it is um it is i mean it looks a bit of a, a smaller profile it doesn't look quite as beefy as the tv leo 2 it does look a bit of a more squat so that's the new one there you go and i said it is already set up from the factory for the brushed motors okay so i'll show you that again later on uh when i bring the camera over uh, so that is the main thing about this kit you've got the uh the welcome uh reintroduction of the tamiya escort uh, 98 body and you've got the new uh tblio4 esc and you've got those cool uh rally wheels that come with it um let's just see as i said you do get move out of the way and that and um, we'll go through it quickly i know you all know what's in there so this is your um, metal parts bags and by the looks of it the uh, some of the gears so you've got your torque tube motor in there and then you've got parts bag a b and c for all the metal parts i uh, can see the uh, springs as well they are friction dampeners on this one as well yeah, your foam bumper and we've got here we've got the very familiar T, um, TTO2 uh, plastic bathtub chassis and then we've got uh, hubs, wheel hexes, shock towers and uh, some of the gearbox casings there What we've got here this is uh, yeah bumpers bumper mounts wishbones and the uh, the friction shock parts also here as well that is your um, the drive shafts out drives and axles on there so again this shouldn't take anyone too long to build up and again there you go you've got the motor mounts battery retainer steering linkage and normal wheel hexes as well you get the also you get the uh the disc wheel hexes in this one as well the brake disc with the hexes on so you can look through the which i don't think you'll see much of them between behind those wheels to be honest but there you go oh and uh what else have we got here we got your aerial tube as well now i forgot about this so you've got here this is your additional uh information regarding the um, escort custom this is for doing uh, the body as well. That's all there. Now, uh, I should have mentioned earlier, but I didn't. This will fit loads of different other touring cars um, and all the holes in it, pick it up, as well as having the wheel arches pre-cut, all the body and mounting holes are already pre-cut as well, which is good. Another thing that I've never liked doing okay and uh they're pretty standard that's your tto2 instruction manual and then here which i should have showed you when i got the body out is the decals now you know there isn't tons of them but there's enough um because it's mainly um sort of bumpers grills uh, window surrounds and lights but you also get your window mask as well which is always good so yeah good stuff right what i'll do is because that's pretty much it for the unboxing um i'm going to move this box off here a minute spread this out for you and then you can get a closer look at it Now, while I was thinking, actually, this one, I'm afraid, is just an unboxing on the channel. Um, I won't be keeping it, building it uh, and running it um, because I just I can't. I've, I haven't got the radio gear for it um, either. And I, I, it's just one that I wanted to, to show you guys, really, more than anything. So I will be moving this one on. Um, as I said, I, you know, the, the chassis, I'm not overly fussed about the chassis. I only like the body and I don't have any other touring car chassis that I could put it on anyway. So um, it is just an unboxing, I'm afraid. Uh, this one, I'm sure there'll be other YouTubers out there that do the whole thing. I just wanted to show it to you guys. Also as well, because 
Um, I will be going into hospital next week uh, for a procedure, an operation I need doing. So I also don't know how many uh, videos will get released. I've got some in the pipeline for you, but I don't know how many and how often will be put up. We'll see. Because also as well, I have got on pre-order. Um, I never meant to order this one initially. Um, I've got the Tammy Thunder Dragon that's coming out soon. So I think when that should arrive, I'll be either in hospital or recovering. So I might not be able to jump on and, and do a video of that one straight away. But that one will be unboxed and built um, on the channel. Right, okay. So we're just finishing this off. Let's get the uh, decals there for you. So, let's see. That there, so you can see it when I bring it over. Okay. Right. So this is the point where everything probably goes awry. We'll just see. So it's hopefully I've got a bit of a. A steady arm we'll say and we'll uh, I'll say we'll bring this over to you and you can have a, a better look at the parts so we'll get the boring bits out of the way <laughs> okay so this is your chassis tub and the instruction manual as I said at the back there what we've got is uh, the wishbones and the bumpers Okay, and then on that tree there, we've got gearbox casings and shock towers, all that stuff there. Just get pretty standard Tamiya TTO2 stuff. In front of us here, again, you've got the uh, the radio receiver cover, the motor cover, um, gearbox um, spur cover, motor mounts as well. And I say up there, you have your axles and gearbox joints and uh, the prop shaft to make it four-wheel drive, and your dog bones, etc. Moving on, you've got the foam bumper now, and we're here looking at the metal parts bag that's got your Tamiya torque tube motor in there, your pinging gears, all your screws, and everything to put the car together. Grease. Oh, I did say as well, this is on plastic Tamiya bushings. As you all know, that's what they usually come with, so you might want to uh, bin those and get some bearings for it which I usually I say if I'm building something myself I would have got the bearings for this but we're not actually building it I didn't bother ordering any now for the good bits so we've got the the rear spoiler for the body shell plus the the wing mirrors there and then moving over we've got the the white rally wheels and tires I think they look absolutely brilliant liking them very much and here it is. There it is, the Tamiya, the new Tamiya TBL 04S or TBLE 04S ESC you get with the kit as well. So that's cool. And then you've got the lovely decals, which will, uh, you know, a minimal, but once there'll be enough to make the body shell look absolutely spot on when it's done. And also the, de the the decals that Tammy provide are always really good. And then here it is, as well. You've got the body shell there, the nineteen ninety eight Ford Escort custom body. I'll just try and turn it over so we can just you can just see it a bit better. And to ignore my unsteady hands. So there you go, a bit of a close up for you there. I say it'd been better. <laughs> I, I know a lot of people will like this, um, so you can paint it yourself. But for the purpose of the video, it'd have been good to have it pre painted. Um, but there you go, there it is. So, right, so that is the new uh, Tamiya TTO2 1998 Ford Escort Custom from Tamiya. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Please do consider subscribing to the channel if you haven't already for more RC content, hitting the notification bell and the like button. And here, as it says, there you go.